Guga told me that he's cooking a whole Wagyu cow in Miami, an entire cow. When Guga tells you something like that, you kind of have to show up. So needless to say, we're in Miami. I've personally been a huge fan of Guga's for a really long time. So I pretty much just immediately got my flights and headed down to Miami. They unveiled the cow and this thing was ridiculous. I've never seen anything like this and it was cooked in this huge smoker. We had Guga swinging around a knife that probably should have been a sword as they portioned out the entire cow. Get a little handsy, Jeremy. Get a little handsy. And even though it was so big, it was cooked perfectly. Guga, what do you think? Crazy madness, that's all I have to say. Absolute madness. He's not lying. Basically every knife, axe, and sword you can imagine was used in this thing. And as if the whole cow wasn't enough, we had some amazing Texas style brisket. Guga, how is it? I took a quick walk to find the second craziest smoker I've ever seen. This one showed up on a truck with a tractor. It was ridiculous. And inside it was a whole smoked pig. I was told this was a special breed, basically the Wagyu of pork. And let me tell you when I say this thing was juicy. After exposing the pork belly, you can see all of that moisture literally dripping off of it. These pieces were not dipped in any sort of liquid. They came right off the pig. And I have never seen anything like this in my entire life. I mean, it was literally a waterfall coming off of that pork. Oh my God. There was also some side dishes. I actually don't think I had any. I'm sure they were great, but my focus was definitely on other things that night. One of the coolest parts from the whole experience was getting a masterclass from two awesome guys on how to manage the fire on a huge smoker like this. It's just completely different from a typical backyard grill. You were my boy, Emilio. Somehow, after all of this, the meat did not stop. We just cooked an entire cow and a pig, and now we're doing wagyu beef. Maybe. Is it fun? Yeah. 100%. Yeah, exactly. I got to help cook some Australian wagyu strip steaks. Cooking for other people is something I really like to do, but rarely have the opportunity. So this was one of my favorite parts as well. Look at that. I left with a major appreciation for Guga. He's a truly humble guy who works hard and takes care of others. And this was easily one of the most fun experiences I've ever had.